Welcome to Math with Mr. J. In this video, I'm going to cover how to subtract a negative integer from a negative integer. So a negative minus a negative. Let's jump into number one where we have negative five minus negative nine. Now when we subtract integers, we can actually add the opposite. The opposite of subtraction is addition. And then we take the opposite of the number we are subtracting. So this gives us an equivalent problem and we are able to use this strategy. So we have negative five minus negative nine here. Let's rewrite the problem adding the opposite. So we start with negative five, add, and then the opposite of negative nine is a positive nine. So negative five plus a positive nine. Well, if we take that negative five and add a positive five, we end up with zero. Then we have four more from that nine, and that gets us to a positive four. So again, negative five plus that positive nine gives us a positive four, and that is our final answer. Now that answer may not make sense at first because we just had a subtraction problem but somehow increased in value and ended up with a positive answer although we subtracted two negative integers there. Whenever we subtract a negative, we actually increase in value. Let's think about how this works and I like to think of this in terms of money. Negatives represent debts or expenses when it comes to money. Think of subtracting a negative like subtracting or taking away a debt or expense and getting that money back. That is a good positive thing and increases the value of the problem. So whether you are subtracting a negative from a negative or a negative from a positive, subtracting a negative increases the problem's value. Let's move on to number two where we have negative 23 minus negative 10. So let's rewrite this problem adding the opposite. So we start with negative 23 and then add the opposite of negative 10. The opposite of negative 10 is positive 10. So negative 23 plus 10. We are increasing in value by 10. That's going to give us negative 13. And that's our final answer. So we started with negative 23 and we added a positive 10 there. We increased in value by 10 and got negative 13. So there you have it. There's how you subtract a negative integer from a negative integer. And remember, whenever you subtract a negative, you increase in value. I hope that helped. Thanks so much for watching. Until next time, peace.